Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. Today's video takes us to banning California at the courthouse with the frauditor known as Alcor Accountability. And he is trying to express his First Amendment rights to film inside of a courthouse, even though there are many things that go on in there that don't need to be filmed, such as attorney-client privileged information. But you can't get that through this idiot's thick skull. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show as he, this moron ends up getting arrested. All right, guys, we're back at the Bannon Courthouse. Last time I was here, they said I was not allowed to film inside the entrance or the lobby. He gave me a piece of paper saying that the judge said that you can't, re it said you can't request record inside the courtroom, and then it says the lobby. He added that. This judge here is a liar. I looked up the same, and I have the evidence document with me right here. I have the same California Penal Code laws, rulings, and it says specifically that you are not allowed to record inside the courtroom. It does not say nothing about the entrance, the lobby, or inside anywhere in the courthouse like that. So there is no law. Well, dude, I think you really should learn how to read. Because I found this particular general order on the California Judicial website, which is a primary source, which is a term I'm going to use later on in this video for clarification on you're in, dumbass, but it basically states that you're not allowed to film anywhere inside of the building, and I would imagine with good reason, because to protect the jurors, for one thing, dipshit. Um, I have a feeling that they're going to violate our rights today, our First Amendment rights, civil rights, constitutional rights, uh, 148 subsection G, right? And there's your other mistake right there. That one particular uh, statute right there states public places. It doesn't say anything about courthouses or courtrooms. So you know what? Do you realize that a courthouse is a non-public forum and judges control those areas? So, the moron, your argument is still not valid. So please try again. But that's for law enforcement, but you know, it includes in there. Uh, Bain Act violation if they try to stop us or violate our rights. And the Bain Act is invalid here because you were not discriminated against based on your race, creed, color, religion, or anything like that. You were asked not to film in a courthouse, which is a non public forum, and therefore not eligible for the Bain Act issue. You just keep on missing the ball, don't you? You might as well quit while you're ahead. So yeah, guys, we're going to go back in there and uh, see what they say, man. But honestly, you got to be prepared to go to jail today. So let's do it, man. Stand up for a constitution. And uh, when I, before I walk inside, I'm going to activate my body cam. Oh, let's do this, guys. That security guard, that fucking jackass, he was so sure that I wasn't allowed to record. But I am. Wrong, 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 wrong. Wrong, 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 wrong. You're wrong. You're wrong. You're wrong. And uh, let me just show the documentation. Because I have it with me. Okay. Right here. One fifty. No recording device cameras in the courtroom. That's all it says. Doesn't say anything else. Oh, let me show you guys. Sorry. We are back. That's right, motherfuckers. 
Well, now, I was going to argue the fact that you didn't have a primary source document, but you, in fact, do have a primary source document right here. It does, in fact, come off the California Judicial website, just like the other document that I showed. But this one right here gives allowances to the judge's discretion for cameras in the courtroom. It is, in other words, it is up to the judge to allow court uh, cameras in the courtroom. So you're basing your whole, whole argument and getting yourself arrested because you misread the document and thought it meant that it was on your side, dude. Man, you are a complete imbecile. A little longer than a few minutes later. Yes, sir. What's up, jackass? I'm back. Outside. Nope. Outside. No, you're gonna have to take me to jail. Get outside. Yeah. Hey, man. Ready to explain? I have the law right here, man. We're gonna explain to you, okay? I have the law right here. Okay. It says camera's not inside the courtroom. It, has, it doesn't say anything about the entrance of the lobby or anything. It is. We just read you that statue. No, that statue, this judge here, uh, he included that himself. Uh, this is the law right here. Shh, relax, relax. Do you have that form with you or no? Which one? It should be in the hard plastic. Bro, I can't believe you guys are violating our First Amendment right, man. They are not violating anybody's rights here, you bloomin' moron. In fact, well, they're protecting other people's rights by not allowing you to film in here, such as people to have the right to attorney-client privilege, and that is one thing they're doing. At least one thing, but part of their job. 148 subsection G, Baynac violation. You have to take me to jail, man. I can't believe you guys don't know about the First Amendment. Go ahead and violate my rights. I'll, I'll, I'll sue you guys. Okay, sir. Then you can do that, but you're going to have to exit. No, I'm not leaving. You're going to have to, okay? No, sir. I have the law for you right there. Okay. Let's come out here. I'm not going you. outside, no. No, sir. Listen, you're gonna have to. What are you? What are you trying to accomplish right here? What do you mean? I'm pro exercising our First Amendment rights. We explained to you. We showed you. I don't care what you guys say. The law's right here. Are you trying to get a reaction from us or a reaction? We talked to you. We had a conversation. Do you. you said I don't want to go to jail. I don't want to sue you, you guys. That. I just want to peacefully go through security and just record, and I'll be on oh, my way. There we go. You guys are making a big deal. Okay. Okay. This includes all media outlets. This apply order applies to the courtrooms. Courthouses, including all the hallways, and offices, who wrote and this? Who wrote that? The presiding, the presiding judge. judge. Oh, this judge? The presiding judge. Okay, yes. it's unconstitutional. Well, if it's so unconstitutional, why don't you take it all the way to the Supreme Court and see what they have to say about it? Oh, wait. Uh, it's very rare that you ever see any cameras inside of the U.S. Supreme Court because guess what? It's not unconstitutional. This, no, this is the state of California right here. That's the same exact, right there, rule 1.150. Read it, read it, look. It says no cameras inside the courtroom. It does not say anything about here. This is official from the California courts. I, I showed him where I showed him where he can read it and he, he took a photo. How do I know he photo. didn't lie or something? If you want, because you can, if you'd like to, you can speak to the Superior Court and talk, go through their chain to figure out that, but this is this all is the law right, right here. here. No, 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 this is right here. This, this is, is it right here. This is what it's gonna be, okay? That's unconstitutional. Well, if you don't elect Greer, it's a public you building. That up with the goal, it's okay? a public building. This is our first amendment. I understand that, but this is what you, you're not understanding. This is from the presiding judge, okay? Regarding okay, I don't care, okay? fuck the judge. Tell him I said fuck okay. him. Oh, we got other direct D on our hands. And that didn't exactly work out too well for him so far because he's a man on the run right now. That's right, he's a man on the run. Where he could be taking care of his children, nope, he's a man on the run. I don't care what he writes. Shh. It's unconstitutional. Down, okay? I'm sorry that you don't I'm not calming down okay. nothing. You are, okay? No, because talking to you guys nice, that doesn't work. I have to get angry. You're not going to enter the building. You're not going to be recording in here, okay? It's okay. Just, it's just what I, it is, okay? I'm not going to listen to you, man. Okay. 
Okay. So you do what you need to do. Call a supervisor. Martinez, I know we were cool last time, okay. but I'm sorry, brother. I'm standing up for our rights and our constitution okay. and what I believe. So you understand why if you're refusing to leave and not recording the building, you'll be subject to an arrest if possible, if that's what it comes down to. If we have to do that, that go what, ahead. Is that what you you understand that? I'll right? file a complaint on the lawsuit because I believe that you're violating our, okay. my constitutional I'm to, rights. I'm trying to show you right now. This is what it is, okay? That's un all the no, that's unlawful. And then that way, if you do go to court, you can say that we showed you this paper, you saw it, and that you're not agreeing with it. So then when the judge asks you why, you No, this you is a clear violation of rights. You can look at, I have the law right here. Yeah, and that law, if you actually read it, states that the judge has the discretion on that particular subject. And, well, guess what? He wrote a ruling on it, which basically makes it legal. Num nuts. This is on the showing you the administrative order right now, okay? I don't care, man. Okay. Do you know why? Because this is from the California courts. This is just for this courthouse. No, this is for it. California. This is very court of the state of California. Yeah. Nah, that's unconstitutional, this judge. What's his name? What's all that? I want everybody's name. Oh, we're trying to show it to you. Okay, Becky. Like Dungeon Martinez. What's your badge number? 4295, sir. Name and badge number? Uh, Bruns, 6693. And your name and badge number, too. Constitutional right. He I doesn't have a badge number. Right. What's your name, sir? You work here. You work for the public. I need your name in case. I don't work for the public. I work for the sheriff's Okay, what's your department. name? You work for the sheriff's department as Ally Universal? Uh, yeah, I work contracted to them. That's all you need. See, he's impersonating an LEO. No, he's not. He's a, lot, a security officer at Allied Universal. He's you just said you're a sheriff's officer. I did not. He says they contract through it. So the sheriff's department hires their services. Okay, well, what's your name? What's your name? Do you tell me yours? No, I don't have to. I don't have to tell you mine? Yes, you do. You work for the public. No, sir, I do not. What's your name, man? In case I want to file litigation, I need to know your name. Well, you bring the paperwork and I'll tell you. You see how they represented themselves professionally? What's your name? Jackass. Okay, it's time to step out. Okay. Yeah, Jackass. Sign step I'm not stepping here. out, bro. You're gonna have to. It's step unconstitutional. Out, okay? You're gonna have to step. Take out, me okay? to jail. I want to go right now. Let's go. It'll be my first time. Just hang time. Yeah. I've been arrested before, but this will be my first time going to jail. As long as you understand, you're refusing to leave. I'm not refusing to leave. You're kicking me out. It's unconstitutional. So, so by kicking you out, telling you you have to leave, are you refusing now to leave? I don't answer questions. I'm not refusing. I have the law right here. Okay. We're just telling you. Are you refusing to leave? You're violating your oath. I'm to the Constitution, bro. This is a public building. Okay. I just want to take some pictures. We just told you, you cannot. That's the presiding judge's court order. Okay? And I have the law right here. Oh, I'm sorry, but ours is going to have to um, supersede that right now. Okay, okay. well, it's unconstitutional. That's okay, what I'm you saying. You can go ahead and file that complaint or lawsuit if you like, and that will go through that. I'm not leaving, bro. That's not my point. It's I want to pass leave. security, actually. Can I go? You're going to what? I want to go through there. No, you're not. Okay, then I'll stay right here. I'm not going nowhere. I'm not going anywhere, man. It's our First Amendment right to the Constitution. I gotta stand up, man. Tyrants. You guys want to, the government wants to take our rights away, but who's gonna stand up and fight for them? Listen, you little jackass. You don't even know what the hell your rights are to begin with. And, uh, you're not the one fighting for your rights anyway. That's been done by, well, the soldiers out in the field for well over 200 years and not by uneducated little twerps like you who just want to go around causing problems. Me. I'm not going nowhere. This is the courthouse, not the room. He says, I want to get a reaction. What an idiot. If he doesn't say anything, nothing will happen. Well, it sounds to me like you just admitted that exa that's exactly what you were trying to do, elicit a reaction. And, well, you're going to get more than that here in the next few minutes when they haul you off. Many, many minutes later. Oh, because they post a policy out there. That's not even the law. All right, sir. Yes, uh, sir. I just spoke to my supervisor. Yes, sir. You have no lawful business being okay. here. You're now asked to leave. If you refuse to leave, you'll be trespassed, okay? Trespass from a public yeah. building? Yes. That's not how it works, man. Okay. Are you refusing to leave? 
Uh, can I ask you the next question? Are you? Are you? Are you I mean, are you going to threat? Are you going to threaten me no with the rest? Threat. That's not threatened. It, it's what we have to do. It's part of our job. Okay. No, no. Okay, okay. I'm here if to I don't leave, questions. okay. Let me ask this other question. I'm very patient with you. I'll give you opportunity. No, I know. But you work for me. If I don't leave, will you arrest me? You're going to have to be arrested for trespassing. If you refuse to leave the property, you have no lawful business. You're not allowed to record. I have a business. You're not, I have business. You're not allowed to record in here. You've been asked that. You've been explained that. You've been shown the court order. I have the law right here. If you don't want to follow that, then you're going to be placed under arrest, okay? But that's not the California law, man. I'm telling you, this is what I ran about my supervisor, my chain of command. Okay. This is, what the, this is what's going to happen, okay? Okay. It's not something we're just making a hasty, rash decision. Uh, we've done I our part. I stand firm on my rights. We've so. done our part. Okay. We've educated ourselves. I've explained that to you, and this is the final time, though, okay? I'm telling you, it's I a need lawful. You to exit the building. If you do not exit the building, my partner here is going to place you under arrest, and we're going to take your property, okay. book it in evidence, and you're going to be booked across the street at the county jail. Well, I, will you release me today? I can't guarantee any of that. Yeah, in a few hours, huh? I can't guarantee any of that. I don't work for the jail. I oh, okay. Right here, okay? All right. So, are you going to leave the building or not? Either way, it's unlawful, man. If okay. you arrest if me you or feel, if I fight if you feel it. That, I explain it to you. Look at yeah. I don't know what your beef is, what your agenda is, what you're trying to accomplish here. Standing up for the rights. I, I, I don't know. Whatever you, you feel you're doing. You don't doing. know about the First Amendment? I do know about the okay. First Amendment. Okay, that's all I'm doing. And I know that I've explained to you. We've had yeah. this discussion. And I know you've been time. patient. The other time, okay? Yeah. And I'm telling you, this is what I have to do. This is my orders. From my supervisor, okay? So I mean, you're saying if so you're saying if I don't leave, you'll you have to take it to jail. If you don't agree with it, I say you can seek legal advice and right. go from there, okay? If you feel it's unlawful, you have that right to seek I know. legal advice I know. and proceed from there. I, I either um, fight it civilly or criminally. Civilly yeah. is always the best way. Exactly. That's why at least you know that because I am I I enforce criminal laws. I'm a law enforcement right. officer. I know that. Civil. No, this is not my first time. I've been doing okay. this for years. Okay, there you go. Well, I'm just telling you, okay? So you're telling me to leave? Absolutely, yes. Wow, uh, look at that guys. So if I don't go, they're going to take me to jail. So I can either take the ride or fight it in court. But either way, it's unlawful, just so you guys know. Okay. Okay. I was, I was hoping you would put me in handcuffs. Okay, sir. All right, I man. To, I try to minimize the, this the best. But you're telling me to leave, right? Yes, sir. Okay. That's all I want to know. Okay. You know my information. I work here. Yeah, I know. You can contact my supervisor. I should have taken me to jail, man. Good day. Wow. Oh, no, those tyrants, they let you walk. They let you leave the building without disappearing you. I mean, what is up with them? They're not doing their jobs, which means you are wrong. They're not tyrants because a true tyrant, well, they would have made you disappear. But it's not over yet. He's about to make that piss poor decision and go right back in there. They should have taken me to jail right now. Either way, guys, they violated my constitutional rights. They said I'm not allowed to film in the courthouse, not even the room. That's not the law, man. I don't care what they say. I have the law with me right here. Not only is it state law, it's federal law too. Either way, they violated my rights. If they take me to jail or not, it doesn't matter. I have to fight this civilly, guys. I'm going to file a lawsuit. This is fucking bullshit. Why didn't he take me to jail? He should have taken. Dang. Yeah, it's because the way I talk. He should have taken me to jail. Martinez, you can take me in, sir. No, I said Martinez can take me in. I'm fine. I'm willing to go to jail. You want to go to jail? Yes, sir. Lobby Martinez individuals back in the lobby. Because I have to stand up for the right thing. Hey, Martinez, I'm ready, sir. For what? To go to jail, sir. Are you refusing to leave the building? I have to stand up. I have to, I have to do what's right, sir. Yeah, are you refusing to leave the building? Sir, take me to jail. Just take me to jail, brother. Okay, go ahead. Okay. Are you refusing to leave the building? Just take me to jail, brother. Okay, go ahead. Okay. All right, yeah. Here, take this. Okay, yes, sir. Here, hand it to him. Take off that, too. Yes, sir. Uh, just Here. press the button. It'll yeah. stop recording. Man, oh, man, what a bloody moron, moron this guy is. I saw no rights being violated. He did his best to push their buttons. He showed them what he thought was the law, 
Well, it it is in the California uh, Judicial Code, but he just misread it, so that's on him. And if he wants to go buy a uh, code that he misread, well, so much the better. I mean, it's his life. So he can wallow in his own stupidity if he wants to. At any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one.